Hey, you guys, and welcome to my December TBR TV Red video. I know, it's been a while. I just stopped, like, a few months ago from, like, doing TBR videos, just in general, sort of, because I know I did a few hashtag year thons but even then, it wasn't, like, yeah, no. But, it's December 17th, and I know this is late, but I still have a lot to, I want to read for the rest of the month, so I thought I'd share it with you. Plus, you guys know I made my Goodreads goal for 100 books. I'm currently at 102. I mean, I wanted to go over this year, but it's amazing that I did. And I'm going to fill my wrap up after this, and you'll probably see why I did it. <laughs> kids books are awesome I'm just not gonna lie and short books and novelettes just yeah so I have a two at least I wanted to read at least one more currently reading and I have two choices for that I have the lowest one which is um Ketchup Clouds by Annabelle Pitcher which I read with Joel Dean I say read with but she read it and I just like stopped half like not even halfway through 96 pages which is just so sad but I feel like having that constraint of just like a page limit we should reach and then I'm here trying to meet her goal is just like bad and I can't do that with uh Geraldine so for all our future buddy reads we're just gonna go we'll just read it that month <laughs> so hmm. plus Nicole over from the girly girl bookworm when I was reading this and talking about it all that whole time she's just saying how much she wanted to read it and after her I believe it was project 50 that she was doing read 50 before she buys any more um she was gonna get this like first thing and she did and she read it and she loved it I believe she gave it a four out of five stars or 4.5 and yeah so I was just like dude I really need to like get to that book again so hopefully is that but this one is the one I more want to finish and it is Night Film by Marissa Pesser I just really I literally have not picked it up since like the last time I looked in it like that's it like I haven't picked it it's just there and I think about it occasionally but like I haven't picked it up so yeah that's just a thing but I really was into it and I really want to get to it no matter what Geraldine says about the ending that she she didn't like the ending so she's been trying really hard not to spoil me I would say very hard but I, she asked me you want to know and I'm like no just I'm just gonna try to read the book first so yeah there we go and it's funny because now me and Geraldine we're gonna read a book together and we're gonna do that we're trying out that we'll read it this month stuff so I'll get to that later but there's one more book I want to finish that's on my currently reading but I don't count it because it hasn't been on my currently reading that long as like opposed to those two. And it is Crest by Marissa Mayer. And yeah, I'm really liking it. But it's like I read Cinder, I read Scarlet, and then I got into Crest. And it's like, yeah, I'm almost caught up. You just got to go over that hump. It's not like I'm low. I'm on uh, page 311. So it's, this, page, this book is like almost 500. No, yeah, it's like 500 and... 60 pages maybe so I'm like halfway through right now over a little over halfway through so I just really need to get like hunker down and like read it because I haven't really picked it up since the last time like I stopped in the middle of it um so there's that and then there's ones I want to read to what Geraldine and it is the name of the wind by Patrick Rochus Rothfuss. I'm really not sure whether we're not we're gonna get to this book but we want to get to this book look at this big thing and hopefully it happens like I feel like once I just like read it and like get into it then I won't want to stop and then yeah that's gonna be a thing and it happens before we get to this one though I feel like we might get to this one first and it is the first 15 lives of Harry August by Claire North and I would like to add though like we me and Geraldine have previously read books together and she hasn't even started like one of them like she didn't even read it like I think she's probably gonna give that book away like like come on like come on I did better terms of buddy read I'm just gonna put that out there yes I am yes now I am <laughs> but anyway the first 15 lives of Harry Hoggins by Claire North I feel like it, it would be funny I feel like Jody may end up reading this one and I'll read the other one and then it'll be like so was that good was it good was it worth reading I feel like that might be our thing um but I'm really excited because I really wanted to read this one for the longest time so I do really want to get to both of them this month and then um Victoria <laughs> I was talking to her and she's like, I think I'm going to read Gone Girl by Jillian Finn. So I may pick it up because she told me I should read it with her. I didn't give her like 100% yes. I gave her like 
a 50-50 chance on this because I was supposed to read it with Geraldine a while back and I just was like, well, it wasn't supposed to. I didn't give her a fern yes either. I was like, if I pick it up, I'll pick it up. So hopefully I'll get to it because I do want to see the movie and it would be better to read the book first. So that's a thing. And then the one last book, so this is like a peek into a future book haul and it is A Big Fish by Daniel Wallace and I absolutely love this movie. You guys, like, love this movie. And <laughs> I just like the book. I read, like, the first couple of pages, and I was just like, oh, it's, like, taking me back. I really need to buy a new copy of this movie, though, because I used to own it on VHS, I think. I think it was. I think I own this book, this movie on VHS. For those of you who don't know, it's, like, something from a long, long time ago. <laughs> Not that long ago, but still. So um, I need to, like, update to a Blu-ray or whatever. Um, but can't wait love the movie love the movie and loving the book so far so that's a thing and those are all the books that I have to show you you guys let me know down below whether you guys have read any of these books whether or not you plan to um, or not you know all that jazz and which ones uh, would you guys think which ones do you think that I will actually finish like let me know down below um i'm gonna talk to you guys later and a goodbye all the good books all the big books keisha